Okay folks, today I'm going to show you the Panasonic SC-AKX 1-4 stereo system. So stay tuned. Okay folks, this is the Panasonic stereo system, the uh, SC-AKX 1-4. As you can see, these are the, uh, the way it looks in front. You have your power button over here, your D-Base, your, let me see if I can get a little bit closer here, your USB manual equalizer, uh, deep bass power forwards and backwards volume control big volume knob right here where you could adjust the volume back and forth um, mp3 USB playback of course this is your CD player you could open and close um, these are the other stuff that here that comes with it here at the bottom some stickers that are connected to it you got your radio extension in these buttons here are for your CDs or USB or whatever. Um, CD, USB. This is uh, for your tracking. This is the model number. Of course, here is your the sides of the unit right here. You can barely see, but there are some vents over there at the side. Over here is your speaker. One of them. The other one is over here. Um, see the. The speakers are very loud, heavy bass. Let's turn on the system now and uh, let's give you an example. This is the remote control that it comes with. Um, you can see right here. These are your remote control buttons. You can see for yourself. Okay. All right, let's turn the system on. Go right here at the top. Okay, I have it on a, a radio station here. Of course, you got your when you set, set it up, you could set it your presets or you could do manual. Um, manually change the uh, dial. Of course, I'm not gonna play any uh, music or noise because of copyright issues. So. Um, the remote control works on one battery, so you don't have to worry about two of them. Uh, the system, uh, of course you have your USB playback right over here. Uh, let's put it on CD. To change the CD, you click the uh, CD button right here. Of course you got your CD. And uh, I have no disc inside, so to open up the CD player, you just press your open and close button right here. And there it goes. Let's close it back, do the same thing. Okay, very simple, easy to operate. And, uh, or I could put a disc inside, let me see. Well, that's gonna take a little longer, so, well, you know how it operates. So you have your track select buttons over here, over here, and uh, over here for for other stuff over here that you could change the dial on the USB and on um, tuning and whatnot. Now I'm going to show you the back of the unit and hold on. Okay folks, I'm now showing the back of the system here. Uh, of course here you have your Panasonic brand name and your model number. Over here you have your FM antenna connection your AM antenna loop connection uh, which is detachable of course you have your speaker speaker left and right connections here um, you have your AC input right here and you have a AUX input or an AUX input left and right channel here if you want to add a turntable or something else many stereo CD stereo system these days don't have one so it's good to have that around and some other information on, on the back so now let's take a look at the front again well that's it uh, I hope you enjoyed my review um, well let me do one last thing here um, when you want to change to uh, to radio or USB or whatever you press this button here a couple times like this you have your FM then you get your AM and then you get your 
USB. No device connected here. And your AUX. Now your my AUX is connected to my turntable, which there's an input that I showed you right there in the back. And my turntable is up here. You can see. I have it hooked up to my uh, Panasonic SE AKX14. So that's my review. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.